A net force of 100 newtons is applied to a 20 kilogram cart that is already moving at 3 meters per second. The final speed of the cart is 8 meters per second. How long was the force applied? Well, this is going to use the impulse equation, which is one of the impulse equations is force times time equals mass times velocity final minus velocity initial. And right here it says how long, how, for how long was the force applied. So we are looking for time here. Time equals question mark seconds. Okay, it tells us that the mass equals 20 kilograms. The force net equals 100 newtons and the velocity initial and the velocity final. The velocity initial is 3 meters per second and the velocity final is 8 meters per second. At this point it is just simply replacing numbers for letters. So it's 100 newtons times T equals mass is 20 Velocity final is 8 minus the velocity initial, which is 3. I can simplify this part right here. So I'm going to rewrite the left hand side 100t equals 20 times 5. 20 times 5, I can simplify that. and that equals 100, which equals 100 T. And then in order to get T all by itself on either the right or the left hand side, I can divide both sides by 100. T equals 1. But in Mr. Fay's class, we are going to respond to the second decimal 100 seconds.